Hello everyone, it's Egbert, and today what we're going to do is uh, the uh, Porter Heights. We're now in Porter Heights, and we're going to look at the Spec Ops mission uh, number one, a deadly takeoff. And we're going to see if we can even do this mission right now. We cannot do this mission until we have a sniper rifle that can either do, uh, or that does both 117 damage and has a 52% uh, stability. Now, if we go and try and start the mission, and we go to Weapon Arsenal, we click on Weapon Arsenal, it automatically takes us to a Tier 2 weapon. This is the Arctic uh, WP, and we can buy it for 39000 uh, 50 coins. So let's go ahead and purchase that and equip it. We now have a weapons master achievement. I'm not going to worry about that right now. And then we'll go back and we're going to go to back again and we're going to go to missions. And we're going to go ahead and again click on spec ops. All right, so again, we need uh, 117 for our damage. We need to be able to go uh, 1,220 feet. We need a stability of 52%, and we need a scope of six, uh, 6x. So again, if we click on Start Mission, let's just see what we can do to upgrade this weapon upgrade. So we definitely need a better scope. Let's upgrade that. All right, we now have a green check mark, so the scope's been upgraded properly. Um, we also need to um, do the body, and it's already clicked on body for us. We'll go ahead and click on 3465 here, and we'll click on confirm. Okay. So we have another green check mark uh, there. The getting the body did it. Now it's telling us we need to do the muzzle, and if we do the muzzle, it's evidently going to do give us what we need. We're currently at 968. Let's go ahead and click on 3,300, and click on confirm. All right, now it's telling us that uh, we should probably do the grip. Right now we're at 42.2%, and we need 52. If we do the grip, we will have enough. So we'll click on this 3905, and we will click on Confirm. And now it's taking us to the ammo, and if we upgrade the ammo, um, it will also take us up to what we need. Right now it's 107. If we upgrade, it'll take us up 10 to 117. So we'll click on the 4510 and click on confirm. And now we have everything to go back and do that mission. Notice that we're going through coins pretty fast up here. So we'll use this back arrow and go back to the mission. And we can now do the deadly takeoff mission. So a mob boss, Andre Johnson, he's escaping town. We have to take down his helicopter. So we're going to go ahead and click on Start Mission. We're going to click on Continue. All right. So we're just going to take down the helicopter. We'll click on Start Mission. And we got a few different places we can go. And we can shoot the... Whoop, whoop. Mission accomplished. So I basically shot the pilot. And I was able to take down the helicopter. And the mission has been accomplished. Notice that we've got 12,520 coins for this uh, mission. As we go through locations and as we go through missions, the amount of the coins will go up. And we definitely need those uh, because each tiered, higher tiered weapon is a lot more money. So um, we'll click on next. And 
and then we're going to click out of here. The next Spec Ops mission is going to be this parachute, and we will click on continue. And here, um, we're going to get little prompts again, more prompts throughout the game. Uh, they, they're constantly asking you or suggesting that we buy a silencer. Um, you really don't need the silencers. I'm just going to click on close. And uh, now we're back to our main menu. We'll go ahead and we'll click on missions. And we're back to the Porter Heights uh, menu and it's taking us to the primary missions. Our uh, next mission to do is uh, a Spec Ops mission. If we click on that, the next one is going to be that parachute. And we are going to need to upgrade our weapon for the parachute mission. So that's it for the Porter Heights Spec Ops mission number one, a deadly takeoff. Thank you for watching.